All right, so let's customize your Cano Scan 9000 F Mark II image scanning settings. So uh, first of all, you're going to want to open your Canon IJ Scan Utility uh, as you installed from the website or from your installation CD. Um, we're going to hit Settings, and let's see. Uh, we're going to be using Scan Gear. Um, this is going to allow you the greatest fine grain control over the images that you produce. Um, any of the other settings or the buttons on the scanner itself, they're all going to have specific filters and adjustments that are applied, um, which do not give us the raw data that we want to work with in Photoshop. So. Um, under scan gear, we're going to enable large uh, large image scans. And we're also going to choose data format PNG. Okay, then uh, we're going to open up scan gear, and you want to be using the advanced mode, not the basic mode. And you're going to be producing a full color scan, um, 48 bit. All right, uh, that has more uh, color information than a regular color scan does. So we're going to choose that option. We're also going to choose 600 DPI output resolution. And we're going to disable all of the image settings. Um, these are adjustments that we don't want to apply at the scanner level. We want to apply these um, types of adjustments and corrections at the Photoshop level where we can make uh, smarter decisions about um, if they're needed. All right, um, so we're going to disable all of these. We're also going to hit defaults for um, this dialog here. Basically, that resets any color adjustments or uh, etc. that have been selected. We're also going to hit uh, preferences. And under the preferences, quiet settings, you're going to want to do not enable quiet mode. Um, the reason being that quiet mode is a limitation you're placing on the hardware which uh, could affect the results of the image that is produced. Um, also, under scan, be sure to enable the 48-bit output. Under color settings, choose none and hit defaults for monitor gamma. Okay, so we can preview um, our platen now. All right, now these particular images are going to have some banding because uh, these two sets had a special foiling process, but we're going to scan them anyways. Okay, I'm also going to um, save this group of settings that we have set up. And we're going to add, I'm going to call it um, raw scan and save. So now every time that we come into the advanced mode here, if we choose raw scan from the favorite settings to drop down, um, that will set up all of our 48 bit 600 dpi disabled image corrections um, and everything else um, that we set up so we want to be sure to uh, do that for future uh, shortcut all right so i'm going to close this and here's my image <laughs>